What's going on guys? Welcome back to a new video. Today we have a new product review of 2021 Panini Illusions of Basketball. These are the Mega Boxes. Two hero review here today. We did the Blaster, so if you haven't seen that one, definitely check it out. And we pulled the very rare card there. And also our last video, which was Packs in Paradise, mixed with random hobby packs. Also, it was a box battle with Ms. Pac-Man, so three of our best series in one. Uh, definitely check that one out. A lot of fun. Me and Ms. Pac-Man on a trip together, and as always, we brought some boxes and uh, did a little rip. So a lot of fun. Check it out if you have not already. So these two Illusions boxes here are the second retail format we're trying. And if you guys like seeing these retail formats, help us out by dropping a like, subscribing, share, comment, especially if you're new, ring the notification bell, and sign up for membership. Get some bonus content. Links down below. Help support the channel. And uh, yeah, appreciate you guys. As always, if you're interested in seeing what these are all about. The uh, information for this will go first, then the opening, then the recap and rating. So uh, for this one here, it's um it's good to see. So it's 50 SRP, retails like 50 to 60, and then the resale is about 50, give or take five bucks. So you can probably find these at some stores online, things like that. They are definitely available. They're not flying off the shelves and more retails are becoming more readily available. So good to see that. Definitely a good thing. Now you have six total cards in every single pack, 10 packs in every single box. So the parallels here, as I turn the box uh, to the back, where we'll see everything, it's not too long here, but so parallels, there's Starlight, which is kind of the rare uh, one to find. So nice looking cards. And there's also a, uh, sapphire which is exclusive to this one and then there's the yellows to 149 so look for those and uh, those are the numbered cards here so then there's the inserts all the retail inserts there now the uh, retail inserts have sapphires and then some are to 149 still sapphire autographs at the bottom there are 215 sapphire those two sets we saw in the blasters so see if we can pull some hopefully we can autos are not the easiest to pull and then even if you pull one sometimes you don't get the most high quality autograph. So we'll see, we'll see what happens and let's see what we get. So in the background we have THT and we have Anthony Simons playing very well. And THT, what is THT gonna first get you? Who knows? Maybe Jeremy Grant, maybe, who knows? It's a fun time. I love the time as the trade deadline approaches, but what are you guys thoughts? What do the Lakers do? It's crazy times. If any of you guys watch Undisputed with uh, Skip and Shannon, then you know the Lakers talk. Lakers is covered about an hour every single day, so we'll see what the Lakers do, but um, Grizzlies have their pick, so I'm uh, rooting against them this year, unfortunately. Pac-Man cards is the IG, right in the back there, it's also linked down below. That's where I post all sorts of stuff, hobby news, a lot of good things going down there recently, so definitely give it a look if you're interested, drop a follow, um, card content, things like that, so there's that back there. All right, so let's see uh, what we have here, get our 10 packs. And hopefully something cool, right? Actually, I think I like the sapphires, the way they look. I saw those and they look nice. I like, I like the way they look. I think last year, I don't know if it was the sapphires, was it? I remember I got one parallel that I thought was like a black one of one. And I think it was a sapphire. So we'll see what we have going on here. So here's the first pack of illusions. Let me know your thoughts on this set, this product in general, but here's the base. All right, let's uh, go through and see what we find. And hey, speaking of uh, Anthony Simons, there we go. Seen highlights. Win slam dunk contest. Congrats, dude. There we go. Anthony Simons and Anthony Simons. Very nice. That's a cool card. I like it. As always, guys, help us out by dropping a like, subscribing, show support in these videos, things like that. Sign up for memberships. Well, many more like it. Your support goes a long way towards helping us do videos like this one. Jalen Smith. All right. Next pack up. Also, we made a TikTok. Link down below. So many things I've uh, made recently. So yeah, TikTok's down below. I'll be posting on there some random stuff, fun things. And uh, first link in the description and the pinned comment. And then also our Discord. Oh, there's our Sapphire. Our Discord, where we have our community of collectors. You can buy, sell, hang out, things like that. That's linked down below as well. It's free to join. So Jordan Clarkson, these are the Sapphires. Cool dual image there. And you can tell these apart. These ones, obviously, you can tell apart. The emeralds from the last one are kind of tough. But yeah, these very, very dark blue. That's Sapphire to me. That's Sapphire. That's a very dark blue. It's a nice blue. It's a really nice blue. They have a Koro there. So as far as parallels go, I think the Sapphires are a thumbs up. The Emeralds, or should I say the base? Not for me, personally. Let's see what else we can get. And then the Yellows. I have not seen the Yellows yet. So and there's LB. They look, they look cool. They look nice. It's just like a really deep, dark blue. It looks real good. CJ LB there. Rookie. We will take it. And Lamello Ball. See, we pulled like no Lamelo ball leading up to now, and at the end of the year, all of a sudden Ant and Lamelo, nothing huge, but we've been pulling them a lot more than 
we were earlier. So I'm happy to see him. We still have a flawless basketball coming up. That's the last kind of big product release for this class until we fully switch over to the new class. But uh, I don't know, maybe we can get that Ant Romello hit we've been looking for. Oh, wait, no. Oh, I don't know. Let's see. Oh. <laughs> Yaka Pertle Auto. All right, yeah. It's an auto. It's an auto. Sweet. All right, so we got Trophy Collection Yaka Pertle there. So, bam. You know, we got an autograph. I did say finding those kind of quality autos is tough to get. Honestly, that's probably middle of the pack. That's not like a bad auto to get. Have you seen autos from retail? You'll take him 10 times out of 10. I'll say nine times out of 10 because uh, we get some guys. Yeah, you, you know, you guys know if you've seen any of these before, you get some random guys. That checklist, take a look at the checklist. You'll be like, what? Like, is this the right sport? But sweet, auto. And then after that, Steph Curry, big shot. Recently, there's a, it just looks so good, especially with the kind of color there. Put that right here. Then we got Giannis, got Wendell Carter Jr. and Saban Lee. Nice. I really wish that these were the 55 point like football. I think Football Illusions is a great product and this one's very different from it. So I wish that they would make it a little more similar because Football Illusions is great. This one, I think it's solid, but it just doesn't kind of blow me away. There's Shining Stars, James Harden. There we go. Acetate cards here. Some of these inserts, so very cool. And uh, yeah, nice looking card. Put that there, it's very shiny. Got some rookie action and some Cole Anthony. Very good, got one, two, and three. This is base, highlights, everything else. Now these are actually pretty comparable to the blasters. They don't differ too much, the contents, like parallels differ, but the format is really just like a double a blaster box, really. It's a nice card there. Base to the side, career lineage, Rashid Wallace. Nice, and these have little embossed kind of pattern, if that's how you call it. Yeah, but I'll put that there. It's a nice looking card. Then we got Moses Brown and Jay Sean Tate. All right. We still have four packs left. One thing I like about these Megas is you get a lot of packs, more packs, more fun. It's always a solid rip. And here comes, I like these. Amazing. Or these must be the uh, parallels, right? So amazing. These, these look so nice. Okay, the light bounces off the car like that. Giannis, amazing. Cool. And then, got Lamar Stevens. All right. So at this point, we will do the usual. We'll see which box was the better one. This is one, obviously two will go next. We'll see which one was the better one. Got an auto already. And a mellow, and a few other cool cards. So JJ Redick Sapphire. But so far, it's been solid. Got a Tillman and Composite there, so put these guys here. I like these cards. So the blue is always a very popular parallel amongst collectors. That's a nice blue. We got Killian Hayes, Instant Impact. And then we got some rookies, of, a rookie of Obi Toppin, don't mind the uh, noisiness. All right, and then our final pack from box one. Let's see, can we get some hmm, yellow? I'd love to see one of those today. We got Jonas, and then we have LeBron, Kongwu, and Achua. So, not too bad. We got our auto, and I'm curious. I know you guys have pulled them before. You guys have told me in the comments or DM something like that. But how often are people pulling like quality autos out there? So, are you getting more of these autos, which... Let's see, I'll, I'll take it. I'll definitely take it 10 times out of 10. Nine times out of 10, I think I said. But how often are you guys pulling like a little mellow or an yeah, I know some of you guys have pulled them before, but I'm wondering just how tough it is to pull them. They're definitely really, really rare from retail. All right, here's box number two. You think box two will beat box one? Or will box one beat box two? Here we go. And let's see what we get from this one. So here's all our packs. There we go. Nice. So 
Scare packs in a stack. And maybe we can get a yellow. I think that's the only thing I really want to see. We've seen the, uh, the auto set. Maybe a redemption. You pull a redemption from here. It's got to be a Lamello, right? I don't think some random. I don't think like rookie rookie Rubio would be a redemption, would he? Or some someone else. So I feel like that's got to be Mel. So you see that? That's crazy. All right, we'll put our base right here. Delo. Got some rookies. There we go. Some guys we saw already. Next one up. All right. We got manual quickly blue. Very cool. Yeah, so the retail products didn't do too many of them in the past. Been trying to do some more of these. So if you guys like seeing retail formats or have one you want to see, feel free to let me know down below. But show support in these vids and uh, we'll do some more. So I always try to do what you guys want to see and things like that. Mix it up with some stuff. So like the last video, for example, which was a great one. Had so much fun doing that where we did our packs in paradise. When we go on a trip, I usually try to do that. It's always fun to do. Um, obviously, I love broken packs, and this pack likes to do it for those. So we did that one. And then you know, some retail we mix up in here, as well as the hobby products. So if you ever have anything else you want to see, just uh, feel free to comment down below. Maybe we can get it going. So who knows, right? Let's keep going down. And now there's so many formats for every single product now. There's illusions, a retail box, blaster box, mega box, everything. Every, every format you can think of, they made it. Got Career Lineage Mellow. And then we'll put that there. It's a nice card. We have Lamar Stevens and James Wiseman, of course. Stay tuned. It's coming. After Flawless, I'm thinking, while we'll still have probably some retail sets left to do, I think that's when we'll do it. The James Wiseman video. I'm ready to go. I'm all ready. And we'll have our James Wiseman. Whoever made this pack actually was... was Keeping us in mind. We have Ja and we have Wiseman. Maybe I designed it. All right? All right. Let's see what we have here. LaMelo Ball. Yes. Instant impact. That's a cool looking background. The pattern there. Very nice. This battle got interesting. And RJ Hampton. Give a sleeve here. There we go. Yeah, so the Wiseman video, it is coming. A lot of you guys are asking what it was. I'm excited to show you guys. I'm excited. We're just waiting for Flawless, and then that should be the last one. I don't think they're making Eminence this year. If they were, that would be the last one. But here we have many, many Wisemans that are ready to steal the show. Get the spotlight on them. The Wiseman cards we've been pulling left and right. They get their own feature. All right, a few packs left. Got some Acetate here. Ja. And... I like these. These look nice. Living Legends. Charles Barkley. So shiny. There we go. And we have Nathan Knight. Yeah, Nathan Knight. Pulled a really big Nathan Knight card. So I'm hoping he's good because I have a, I have a good card of his. All right, here we go. We have Rookie Rubio. I jinxed myself. That's all me. Rookie Rubio. We'll put him here. You know, good for rookie Rubio. And Cole Anthony. Now he actually deserves to go there. Last two. Can we get a yellow? Maybe we got a yellow and we just didn't know it. Maybe this was like a yellow. Brandon Clark, Grizzlies. Wish it was Bane. Love Clark though. Great player. Jay Sean Tate. Final pack. Here we go. Will there be a yellow? We have an acetate, I think it is. Okay. Yellow. We have Mystique. I like these ones. These look nice. Mystique. Devin Booker. So shiny. And close off with Obi Toppin and Lomelo Ball. Ooh. All right. One last Hail Mary from box two. Vote down below. Which one was the winner? This was, uh, it was close. Let's do a recap. Let's see what we got. So, yeah, there's our mega box opening. And if you want to see more formats of this product or any others, comment them down below. And here's a uh, here's what we got. So got some cool inserts. I like that Giannis one, Cole Anthony, and a Curry Lamelo Ball. Got the blue Ellaby or not blue Sapphire, and 
Yaka Proto Auto, yeah. Then some more rookies and uh, parallels and kind of concludes it. So solid stuff. Always nice to get an auto. I feel like we've been getting some good luck with autographs lately in retail. Not the easiest thing to pull, but we've pulled a few autos from retail. Nothing insane, but I'll take it, right? All right, then we have Lamello, Devin Booker, Rookie Rubio, Lamello, Wiseman, Quickly Blue. It was close. This is actually, I don't know. I really don't know which way we're going here. Bunch of more rookies and inserts. Sapphires, things like that. Hmm. This is this is tricky. So here's the halls. Box one. Lamello got an autograph, blue Giannis, and a bunch of other good stuff in there. I just chose three. This one has these three at the top. Hmm. Interesting. Alright, comment down below your response. And I'll say mine. Don't want to kind of influence the, the vote here, but I'm gonna go with I think this one I like a little better. The auto is nice, but I love the blue quickly. Looks nice with that jersey match, and this metal is really cool. So I'll go with that one. So uh, thoughts, rating for this product. Now, it's not really too expensive um, over SRP. That is 50 SRP, and you'll probably find them for 50, maybe even less if you're lucky. So uh, it kind of reminds me exactly of the Blasters. It's just a Blaster times two. The main difference being the autographs. I think the Blasters are to 25. These ones, the parallels, that is, would be to 15. Then the yellows are to 149 in the Megas. The rubies are to 125 in the Blasters. So the Blasters are like a hair better, although I like these parallels better. So I'm going to give them a 5.25. I think that's the same I gave the Blasters. But that's what I would say for, for these ones. I think they're pretty much about the same. Just comes down to which parallel you like better. And uh, kind of it. They're, they're really, really similar formats. Not too crazy. The uh, ceiling isn't too high. The floor is decent, though. And it's just a solid product. Nothing that's going to knock your socks off, but it's a... Nice set, and you can probably find it relatively easily. So, yeah, I'll give it a 5, a 2, 5 out of 10 there. And got some cool stuff. Got some Lomelo, Lomelo, quickly. Can't complain with the polls at all, and an auto. So, nice stuff overall. Always fun to open these as always. And once again, you have any suggestions, stuff you want to see, comment down below. A lot of new videos coming soon, so stay tuned. And, uh, yeah, maybe we'll be back here with uh, the next Illusions format. I'm sure there's more. Uh, students so stay tuned for that one and vote once again down below for the winner so does this one guys thanks for watching like comment subscribe and i'll see you guys later